guys, thanks for stopping by. In today's video, we're going to try on all of the spring and summer shoes that caught my eye at Walmart. My name is Teresa. I'm so glad that you're here. Now let's get started. This is actually part two in this series. If you missed the first video, I will link it in the cards above and you can watch it after this one. I do want to say a huge thank you to today's sponsor, Green Chef. We'll talk about them more in just a little bit, but for now, let's look at the shoes. The first pair that caught my eye was a pair of slides. I did pick these up in store, but they are also available online. I will link everything in the description box below, including the outfits, any of the pieces that are still available that I'm wearing during the try-ons. They're calling these the two band chain sandals. They are $19.98. These come in sizes six through 11 in whole and half sizes, which seems to be the standard range for Walmart. I have an average width foot, but if you have a wide foot, Walmart does offer wide width selections as well. It doesn't always cross over to the same exact styles though I have noticed. I wear typically a size eight, and if any of these shoes do not fit true to size, I will point it out as we go along. These chic and stylish sandals come in two colors. What I'm showing, they're calling white, but these are definitely more of an ivory. I just wanted to point that out. They also come in a classic black. These feature a memory foam footbed. They also have a really nice textured non-slip sole with a little quarter inch block heel. And my favorite part is this gold tone chain detail across the top of the band. This detail has been on trend for a while now and it is still going strong. I really like it, especially gold tone. These are such a classic neutral shoe. They are going to go with absolutely everything. I have noticed that online, these are coming in and out of stock. So if you do wanna order these online and they're out of your size at the moment, be sure and check back because they are restocking frequently. The next pair that I wanna talk about is also a slide. I do have other styles coming up in just a little bit. These are by the brand Scoop. So these were an online purchase purchase for me. These are called the Strappy Knot Slide Sandal. They are $30. These also come in sizes 6 through 11, and they are available in four colors. I'm showing what they're calling gold, and it's a really soft, pretty gold. I just love this particular shade. They also come in black, and then a fuchsia, and fuchsia is very much on trend right now. And then they have another color they're calling olive, but honestly, to me, it looks more like a lime green. These elegant sandals have a knotted upper, a comfort footbed with a flexible outsole, a one quarter inch stacked heel and non-slip soles. I do want to point out that where the knot is right here at the top of the shoe, it is textured on the underneath side so that if you have a very sensitive foot that might irritate you. For me, it was perfectly comfortable. I don't really have problem feet. And I think that we all know at a glance what shoe styles work for each of us and which don't. But my experience with this one was that it was perfectly comfortable. I love this soft gold color so much. I think it looks pretty with a dress, but I could also see wearing this with jeans, with shorts, with capris, with a skirt. I think they are so pretty. Now, once in a while, for whatever reason, I just really love a sandal, especially in the summer that has some bling on it, because I love the way it sparkles in the sun. These are by Madden NYC. They're called the Embellished Footbed Sandals. They are $24. They come in sizes six through 11. These are available in three colors. I'm showing this pretty blush color. They also come in black that has silver embellishment and also a crisp white with the silver embellishment as well. These have a contoured footbed. Both buckles are adjustable so that you can adjust it to the width of your foot and get a better custom fit. These have lug non-slip soles, and I do want to point out that they have a more substantial feel and a little bit more weight to them. I don't think that they're overly heavy, but I just wanted to point that out. The contoured footbed reminds me a lot of the Time and True footbed sandals that I showed in my last video, but the Time and True pair are a little bit lighter, and I also found that the pair by Time and True had a little bit better arch support. I will link those below as well. I personally love a sandal that sparkles in the sun, as I mentioned, but if these have too much bling for your taste, you might want to check out the pink Time and True 
slides that I showed in my previous video. These have just a subtle bit of sparkle. I just wanted to show you a side-by-side -side comparison of the Madden pair compared to the Time and True. Obviously, the Madden pair are encrusted with little gemstones, so they're very sparkly, but they have a very similar silhouette. They both have that contoured footbed, which I personally find to be very comfortable. Either would be a good option. So if you like a little bit of bling, you might like the Madden one. And if you want something that's more of an everyday shoe, you might like the one by Time and True better. It's getting to be dinner time and I am so relieved that I don't have to run to the grocery store, scramble for a meal plan, and figure out what I'm going to do because I have Green Chef meals in my fridge ready to go. Green Chef is a CCOF certified organic meal kit company that helps you cook clean, delicious meals with full color step-by-step -step recipe cards and pre-measured premium ingredients, which saves a ton of time in the kitchen. Tonight I've decided that I'm going to make the Cuban chicken with chimichurri. This restaurant quality meal comes together in 20 minutes flat. This recipe is super simple. We're just going to give the veggies a quick chop. We're going to season the chicken with the pre-measured spice mix, and then we're going to saute. Then we're going to plate it up and drizzle on some of the creamy chimichurri with avocado mayo and top it with the cotilla cheese. My kitchen smells amazing and I cannot wait to taste this. Mmm. This dish is bursting with flavor. It has juicy chicken and then the crisp snap peas and bell pepper. I'm going to need another bite. Green Chef has options for every lifestyle. So whether you follow keto, paleo, vegan, vegetarian, Mediterranean, fast and fit, gluten-free. They also just launched a new meal preference called Protein Packed. Each of these meals contains an average of 40 grams of protein, which is perfect for a low-carb lifestyle, which is what I tend to follow. Next, we're going to make the one-pot Tuscan chicken soup. This one has zucchini, sun-dried tomatoes, Parmesan cheese, and some toasted almonds that add just a little bit of crunch. This soup was so satisfying and delicious, my husband loved this one. Green Chef makes it super easy to customize your order. You can even mix and match between the different dietary preferences. Next, I made the Italian Shrimp Garden Bowls. With all of the ingredients fresh and ready to go from Green Chef, this dish came together in no time. I especially liked the flavor of the included lemon herb sauce. It added a ton of flavor. I love that with the quick and delicious meals from Green Chef already in the fridge, I can spend more time doing things that I love, like spending time with family and friends and making videos for you. To get started, go to greenchef.com, use my code TeresaRenee60 and get 60% off plus free shipping. You can also go to greenchef.com for more details. I do want to say a huge thank you to Green Chef for sponsoring this video. Now let's get back to the fashion. In my previous Walmart shoe video, I showed a couple of pair of Pioneer Woman shoes and you ladies loved them. So I wanted to pick up another pair and I was really drawn to these. These are called the Printed Espadrille Wedge. They are $32. They come in sizes 6 through 11. And I have noticed that the Pioneer Woman line seems to run a little bit big. I can actually go down to a size 7.5 in these and I typically wear an 8. So I just wanted to mention that, that you might want to consider going down a half a size. These are available in three gorgeous prints. I'm showing what they're calling Feather Toile. They also come in a lovely begonia bloom. I just think these are so pretty. And then a striking pattern that they're calling wallpaper print. I actually had a really hard time deciding between the three prints because I truly loved them all. These feature a two and a half inch wedge on a one inch platform. So although they look quite tall, they're very manageable. These have an adjustable buckle on the ankle strap a cushioned footbed, a non-slip sole, and the wedges are trimmed all the way around in this natural colored jute. I think that the white and blue toile print is so pretty with the chambray denim trim. 
Something else that I really like about this particular pair by the Pioneer Woman is that for a substantial looking shoe, it is on the lightweight side. I am all about comfort and I don't like heavy shoes. I don't want to feel like I'm wearing bricks on my feet, especially when it's hot and you're walking around a lot. These are remarkably light, as were the pair that I showed in my previous video by the same line. I want to compare that to the Madden. These have a heavier feel to me than this pair, so I just wanted to point that out. If you like a wedge, but you want something a little bit more neutral, and I totally get it, I want to share a pair with you that I found on Amazon. In the spring and summer, wedges are one of my go-to styles, and this particular pair is one of the most comfortable ones that I have found to date. These are by a brand called Dream Pairs. They are $35.99, so just slightly more expensive than the ones by Pioneer Woman. These come in sizes 5 through 11, whole and half sizes. I do find these to fit true to size. These are available in six wearable shades. There is not one among the bunch that I would not have a use for actually, and I'm considering picking up a second pair because I love them that much. I'm showing what they're calling nude, which is a light top. These also come in a classic black, and I especially like how on the black pair, the jute is still a natural color so that it doesn't give that heavy look to the foot. They also come in a pretty soft blush, which I am so tempted by a camel, which goes with everything. They also have navy, and it's been my experience over the years that it can be hard to find a good navy shoe. And then they come in a crisp white. Similar to the pair from the Pioneer Woman, these also have a wedge heel on a platform. So even though they look tall, I personally find these fairly easy to walk in and pretty comfortable also. These also have non-skid soles, they have a cushioned footbed, and they're trimmed in that same natural jute. My favorite thing about this particular pair is that there is no fussy buckle. The pair from Amazon has a wide elastic band right here. You've probably noticed while you're watching my videos over time that I very rarely wear a dark shoe, especially if I'm wearing a dress or shorts. And that's because I want to elongate my leg as much as possible. I am five foot four. This particular shade is very similar to my skin tone, so it blends into the foot. I think these are so comfortable and they're also leg lengthening. Okay, this is a little bit embarrassing, but does anyone else have to use their hands to get their feet into the position like I was sitting in in the thumbnail? My 60 year old legs do not work like they used to. I can't get used to seeing my hair straight in the viewfinder. Usually when I'm filming, my hair takes up half of the frame. A few moments later. My microphone works so much better when it's plugged in. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> If you want to know what the number one spring shoe trend is, you're going to want to watch. I am doing a lot of talking with my hands. I need to tone it down. There are a ton of spring and summer shoe options out there. If you want to know what the number one spring and summer shoe trend is that anyone can wear, you're going to want to watch this video next. Thanks so much for spending a little bit of your day with me, and I will see you next time.